What's up OGs, Hongli in here. Welcome back to OG Fitness. And in today's video, I'm gonna talk about John Wick, Jake Mace, and being true to yourself. Well, at least me being true to myself. Anyways, uh, so let's start. Now, John Wick, what's, what does John Wick have to do anything with this? Well, it's somebody, it's one of the subscribers, right? Or I think he's a subscriber anyway. Uh, his name is John Wick, left a comment regarding uh, Jake May saying that I have no honor because um, I didn't check like two sides of the story, you know, because I know there's beef between Jake Mace and some other YouTubers, right? And I made a video at one point saying that I actually kind of like Jake Mace, you know, like I don't know much about him. I know that he's very controversial. People say that he's lying and doing uh, misrepresenting uh, CMA, right? Chinese martial arts and stuff like that. So yeah, sure, okay, you know, whatever. But I, I still stand, like, I'm still standing my ground on this. That when I watch the guy, you know, when I watch some of his videos to see like what was uh, what was he all about, like, I'm like, yeah, he's articulate. He seems like a very nice guy. You know, he does his thing. Uh, I like the style. You know, the, his demeanor, the way he talked, the way he moved, and stuff like that. Now. Yeah, and then so I'm getting a lot of uh, a lot of hate for that. So that's 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 weird. Well, not a lot of hate, but some people are hating on me because you know I I I, I said I like the guy. I found him okay. So that was kind of funny to me. Now, so this guy writes uh, this John Wick dude. You know, criticized me for for not knowing both sides of the story. You know, because you know Jake Mace is supposedly beefing with uh, other guys on YouTube, not knowing both sides of the story. And that the other guy is just defending himself and Jake Mace attacked him first. And I mentioned this in the comments at one point to this guy, right? Or girl or whatever. I told him, listen, man, I don't, I don't care. I don't have time to dig into people's beef on YouTube. I got, I'm, I'm busy grinding. I got things to do, man. You know, I'm training, I'm making videos and, and stuff like that. So, and I'm 40 years old now at this point. Like, I don't give a fuck what's going on, what you guys are beefing about. Like, you guys are beefing, that's fine, you know, like, whatever. And I'm still gonna, I'm not gonna hate on a guy or hate somebody just because, uh, you know, the Chinese martial arts community hates him. Like, that's your fucking problem, guys, you know? And you know what? I'm gonna be really, really, uh, um, I see how it is now, you know? Because at the beginning, I, I made some videos, I was criticizing people, and I still think that was the wrong approach, and then I apologize for that, and I made a couple of videos regarding that. So I won't ever attack anybody personally, but I think, you know what, like regardless of how, then after that I changed, I tried to be more uh, PC about shit, you know, like more politically correct, and, and to not step on toes, and, and kind of like to be more open, and I am, I am, I am more open, like, you know, uh, in terms of uh, this and that. But meaning, like, you know, regarding the more traditional martial arts and stuff like that. But I realized that you're damned if you do, you're damned if you don't anyway. People are going to hate on you and, and write these comments. And so this guy, this John Wick character, uh, goes on and says that I have no honor do I have honor? Some stuff like that. So I'm like, okay, whatever. This guy's crazy. You know, for somebody who, who, uh, writes his name down as John Wick, you know, and then after that has, then, then goes and then, you know, criticizes and stuff like that. So hiding behind this, this name, John Wick and having a, a, a picture of, uh, you know, himself or some dude jumping in the shadows or something like that. Like, yeah, something stuck up his ass. I mean, you talk, you're talking about honor? I, I don't know, buddy. So anyways, all that to say that uh, whatever, you know, but here's the thing. I stand my ground. That video that I watched of Jake Mace, I still think he's, you know, uh, I remember saying that it was a cool video. I, I enjoyed it for, um, for what it was. That's it. Now, do I know about Chinese martial arts? Whatever. I did Kung Fu before. And you know what, guys? I'll tell you the truth, man. All right. I know I'm going to lose some of you, but I don't believe that any of that shit works, man. Really, really, you know, like I made some other videos about it and none of that stuff works. Maybe it was made, you know, and I made some other videos where I explained like, okay, 
depends on the context, you know, what it was invented for and stuff like that. But if we talk purely hand-to-hand combat, one-on-one, those traditional arts don't work. That's just my opinion. Agree, don't agree, that's fine, you know. And um, that's it, man. So I'm going to stop being, I'm going to be less and less uh, politically correct and trying to please everybody, especially guys from the traditional martial arts and stuff like that. Uh, because, you know, like I, the way I see it now is that, you know, whether, regardless of what you do or what you say, people are going to end up criticizing you anyway. So whatever, you know. So, okay, so that being said, let me just uh, gather my thoughts here for a second. So I'm going to be more, really, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to really let you guys know what I think. Like I'll, not that I'm trying to be PC about it, but I'll, I'll, I'll try to be, to communicate my thoughts and ideas clearly about why. I think that, you know, uh, certain things, the traditional arts don't work. Uh, I, I probably, I touched on it already in other videos, but I think it bears repeating a little bit. So a lot of these, um, they're just not adapted. These traditional martial arts, they maybe worked back in the days when, when nobody knew anything, or maybe it was invented, you know, for a very specific purpose to fight off multiple attackers, maybe with weapons or, or whatnot, or blah, 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 blah. You know, I learned a lot of interesting things, you know, like reading all the comments and stuff like that. But in the end, like if you guys want to learn how to defend yourself, uh, I'm talking about one on one hand to hand combat. Then, you know, I don't think uh, you could uh, you could do so effectively if you don't know any boxing, uh, grappling, you know, judo, wrestling, sambo, uh, BJJ, right? Thai boxing and uh, kickboxing. And of course, uh, Taekwondo for the kicks is great also. You know, but that's it, man. You got to be, you know, it's, it's MMA and like all, all, all the things you see in MMA, that's, that's the shit that works. Everything else doesn't work, you know? Um, so that's it. That, that's really like the way I see it now. Okay. And regarding this, uh, John Wick character. Now I don't care. Like people will say what they say. I usually just block them, you know, but uh, I felt like I wanted to make this video because I wanted to come out and really say to, to, well, to everybody in the community, uh, that you know what, fuck it. I'm just going to really be myself from now on, you know, and I'm not going to try to PC it, like be too, uh, too nice about what I say. Of course, I'm not going to be uh, an asshole just to be an asshole, but you know, I do have strong opinion on certain things and uh, I'm going to express that. Now, this John Wick uh, idiot here said something that, which I, I really didn't appreciate, you know, so I'm going to block his ass. So if you're watching this, uh, you know, like, uh, uh, I'll probably leave this up for a couple of days, but I'm going to block your ass, motherfucker. Yeah, that's right. You know, you damn pussy. But John Wick, motherfucker, you ain't no John Wick. Get the fuck out of here. All right, so back to what I was saying. Now, the reason why I'm a little bit uh, pissed about what this motherfucker said is that, well, first of all, it wasn't con- constructive criticism. It was just, you know, like trolling and shit like that. But w- one thing that he said that, 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 that kind of like, made me really decide, okay, I'm going to block this idiot, you know, is that he said uh, something about like, ha, 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 what channel? You have a hundred subs. What do you have, dickwad, Mr. John Wick, zero subs? Not that I really care that somebody has subs or not, you know, that's, that's not the issue. But what it is, is that if he doesn't consider himself part of the community, right, Hundred to hundred people to me. It's actually 163. Anyways, but that's 163 people. Now imagine if you were in a room with 163 people, right? And that's the way I see it. Then that's that's a, that's that's a big group of people, man. You know, that's a, that's so that's a community for me. You know, so to speak. Might not be considered a community on YouTube. YouTube, you need like a thousand, but you know, 163 people who are potentially like listening to you and and what you're saying. I think that's uh, that's good. So this motherfucker, I'm gonna kick him off because what, you know? So if you're not, if you're not, if you don't feel like you're part of, a part of the community, so I guess you're just here to, you know, uh, jerk off and I don't know, maybe you're whatever, <laughs> you know, and, and putting down these comments. So that thing I didn't appreciate, and that's when I realized that ah, this guy is not in the community. I'm gonna block his ass, and that's when I realized too that you're damned if you do, you're damned if you don't. Now. In terms of, you know, like if you, you can be hated on even if you if you try to hold yourself back and not be yourself. So might as well be yourself, right? At least uh, then, 
you know, it's, it's much easier. Not to say that um, I'm going to go around insulting people and, and, you know, none of that, none of that craziness, you know, all right? But I'm definitely going to definitely gonna express myself and communicate my ideas uh, a little bit more, more strongly. Okay, so that being said, uh, this rant's been going on for a little bit too long, I think. But <laughs> what I'm going to try and do from now on is that uh, I'm going to try to document as much as I possible, kind of like a video blog, uh, uh, you know, a daily, yeah, probably daily. I'm going to give it a tr give it a try to make it like a daily thing where I'm vlogging, so to speak, about, you know, what I do and, you know, my, my journey to, to black belt in, in judo. Because for those of you guys who don't know, I got my brown belt re recently. So I'm going to go try and get my brown uh, black belt. So that's going to take a little while. Um, and then somebody suggested, somebody in the community, right, suggested that I, you know, film all of this, try to like, you know, get it on, on film, like the trainings and this and that and what I do. So to be honest, guys, uh, I just started on YouTube. It hasn't been too long. Uh, I got actually more or less comfortable talking in front of the camera like this in, uh, at my place at home, right? But like going outside in public with a camera <laughs> and talking when there's like other people around, uh, it's something I'm going to have to, to, uh, to get used to. So I'm going to try, I'm going to start trying it tomorrow. Um, and we'll, we'll see how that works out. I'm sure I'll get used to it, but it's a little bit weird at the beginning, right? Cause then, you know, there's other, like, it's one thing to talk and, and have nobody around. Like I got my dog running around and, and I might have my wife just sitting around, but she's, you know, uh, even, even at the beginning, just having my wife there was kind of nerve wracking, even though she's not even paying attention. Cause she's like, you know, has her earphones on and watching something else. But now doing it with other people, I'm kind of like uh, a little bit, uh, chickenish about that. And also one of the other reasons that I haven't been really filming anything um, in judo and showing it to you guys like while we do the courses and stuff like that is because my, my judo coach is kind of a pain uh, regarding that. Like he, uh, I got yelled at a lot for filming because well, he wanted me to concentrate on training, right? So I could understand that. And by the way, um, this is, we're, 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 we're changing clubs soon. Like my, my competition coach is changing Actually, should I be saying this on video? Because some of you guys are actually on my team here. Anyways, yeah. So we're going to be changing uh, places soon and club soon. So I don't even know if I'm going to be allowed to film there. I hope so. I'll try at least. Uh, we'll see what happens there. But I'll definitely start um, filming more like in the car when I go to the gym because, you know, I work as a trainer and I actually opened up my schedule. I'm going to work like seven days a week now. And, and so uh, I won't be, I, I probably have less time making these nice thumbnails for you guys, <laughs> but that doesn't matter. But so I'm going to give that a shot. I hope that, uh, you know, I'll document my things a little bit more, uh, try to get, what's the word I'm looking for? Un, uh, unshy about having other people around and me talking to my camera doing this. But yeah, that's it guys. So that's for this video. Uh, I hope that was somewhat entertaining. And yeah, so I'm going to start filming more, um, you know, the stuff that I do to um, my road to black belt, so to speak, you know, all the training, all the weightlifting. And of course, you know, remember this channel is also about fitness, not only martial arts. So I'm going to, you know, talk a lot about fitness too. And since I work in a the gym, then, you know, I'll, I'll have to check with my boss, but I think it's okay that I'm, you know, filming shit while I'm doing, uh, all my free time, of course, when I'm at the gym or even if I'm messing around with my clients, I mean, training my clients, but I, I mess around with them too. Anyways, that's it for this one, guys. Hope you enjoyed that. See you in the next one. Thank you very much. Peace.